А нас в лодку не взяли. Михаил взяли, да? А, вот Михаил. Ты стоишь? Угу. А какие террасы ты видишь, да? I'm keep it open. Yes. No. So we're gonna spin around here. All right. So again, my name is Bryce, and welcome to Australia, the Australia River. So this is your tour, ladies and gentlemen. If you have any questions about the river, the chasm, about me, I'm a pretty cool guy. Anything you want to know, wow. answer any questions I have for you. If you like history, I'll tell you history facts, whatever you want to know. I'll try to answer the best of my abilities. So if you have any questions, just stop me in the middle of my sentence. Otherwise, we're just going to keep talking. Who built those walls? So, people. Name, so, who name, the wall? so name this, was man, this was not man made, this was carved in by the water. Yep, the water carpets. Was there another question? It's okay. Water temperature, I can, uh... water temperature. Water temperature is pretty warm today. I would say mm, 50 something. Oh, really? It's pretty warm. Well, if you'd like to drink some and swish around your mouth and spit it out, feel free. <laughs> This altitude of these rocks. It's about 100 feet up. 100 feet? 100 feet to the top. Yep. 150. So, interesting fact. So, are you guys from the area? Are you guys from all over the place? Or? We are from, from Vermont. Vermont. Where are you guys from? Montreal. Montreal? Yeah. Montreal, Laval, Verdun. Come on, Boudic. Они сказали не трогать. А, да? Да. This looks like we are goes down. Yeah, so that's a very good point. So it's a really cool illusion, the way the rocks are going up like this. If you actually, if you actually look behind us, you can see how it does kind of look like we're going downhill. Just because of the way the rocks are formed. Anyone know what kind of rocks these are? They are! They're sandstone! Very good. If you look to the right right here, you'll see some concrete with a pipe coming out of it. Uh, and we've been launching boats since 1873, and we didn't have this Kevlar blue rafts. So we have wood, big wooden boats that can handle about 30 people and weigh about 2,000 pounds. So at the end of the story, you're going to see I put the boat on a ski lift to raise it up, uh, raise it up the hill at the end. Back then, they had a pulley system, so they used a whole bunch of livestock to uh, pull the boats out of the water. That's how they used to do it. So, coming on the right, ladies and gentlemen, back here. <laughs> yeah, feel free to take all the pictures you want. Uh, just at this point, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like you to put your feet underneath the tube in front of you. Now, if you want to hold on to the black webbing, the black rope beside your tube, feel free. Uh, okay. Definitely make sure your feet are underneath the tube in front of you. <laughs> In the second one. <laughs> <laughs> so also ladies and gentlemen, I've only flipped four boats today, hopefully you're not the fifth, so fingers crossed. <laughs> also there are yeah. Alright, here we go ladies and gentlemen. Three, two, one, here we go! <laughs>
Whirlpool okay. Basin. Notice Ooh. that the water looks like wow. it's swirling in the middle there with the sun oh. and the water. <laughs> also called Tuber's Graveyard because tubers always get caught here. <laughs> wow. ah. Oh my god, these guys, people get it, no? Oh no, no, no. So they got off and came back in. They got off the stairs back there and they got put back in. Let's go back. You want to go back up? Yeah. <laughs> This is also, you see, the illusion. Yeah, but it's going down. Yes, yes, yes. If you catch this illusion, I hope, I don't know the result. You see? This is look, looks like yes, yes. the water is like that. Mm -hmm. So I don't believe I told you guys any of my bad jokes yet. Let's see, what do I got? Uh, oh, why, was the bicycle, why could the bicycle not stand up? 